help, help, help. Good morning. If you're happy with everything, um, feel free to use. You know what? Let's go for a drink. Uh, where do we go for a drink? Around here. Oh, look at this top hat guy. I'm gonna follow him. Yeah, um, I just came in for a drink. Um, I think that's what we've all done, but there doesn't uh, seem to be any staff. I think they're still waking up, but hopefully should be awake soon. Yeah, I mean, everyone needs a drink in the morning, I think. It gets the heart going. Oh, yeah, <laughs> well, I agree. <laughs> What's your name? Uh, my name is Clemens. Clemens, nice to meet you. I I'm Eldon Irwin. Eldon Irwin, pleasure to meet you, uh, Mr. Irwin. Are you uh, new in town, or...? Y yeah, you bet. I, I got off the train yesterday, and, uh... <laughs> You're welcome. I've, I've, to tell you the truth, I've never been outside of St. Denis before, and, uh, so I'm just trying to find my way out here, and people have been very nice and very helpful. Oh, well, that's good. That's good that you've been, uh, uh, you know, meeting good and <laughs> helpful folks, yeah? That's excellent. Uh, maybe I'll get a job here one day. Ah, maybe. Uh, here, anywhere you can uh, think of. Uh, there's lots of opportunity everywhere. Mm -hmm. Oh, excellent. Yeah, I I'm not much of a gunslinger. Everyone here looks really tough. Uh, I'm, I'm more of an inventor and a salesman. Ah, uh, there's definitely places that uh, could use those, though. Yeah, you bet. I've got a new device that I'm trying out. It, it's, uh, yeah. it's a toothbrush, and it and it it shakes in your mouth when you use it. Ooh. It's got a, it, sixty percent of the time it spits out oil in your mouth, but oh. the rest of the time it's been working pretty well. So, I mean, I think I'm gonna try and sell that in here in Valentine when the first prototype's ready. I'd like to see a prototype of this. Yeah, me too. I well, definitely have it in the gun store, you know, your own little stand there, maybe, you know. Oh, the Elden Irwin stand. I can see it already with my name and lights Ooh. and fireworks. <laughs> Okay. Well, it was nice meeting you two. Have a pleasant day. Yeah. Bye-bye now. You too. What a lovely fella. That is all. Elden Irwin. Making friends everywhere he goes. Now time to find a way to raise a thousand dollars. For my inventor's laboratory. Hey, Gadget, how you been, buddy? How you been, young man? Oh, nice. Good skin.
sell the pelts first. Let's see how much money I get for this uh, perfect ram help pelt. Dollar and four cents. You know what? I don't know if this is the life for Elvin. <laughs> He's got to make a thousand dollars. I'm not shooting a thousand deer. Uh, I thought I'd be making more money, but it's, it's, it's just not enough. Yeah, I feel that. Where you been hunting at? Uh, I tried the Heartlands, and I, I tried a couple other places. But, um, I don't know if I'm cut out for this work. I, I'm an inventor and a salesman. Oh, what are you doing hunting then? Well, you see, I, I had a, a stretch of bad luck out in St. Denis, and... I had to come out here to try and uh, rebuild my life, but but I'm an inventor at heart, and so I've I've got to raise money for my prototypes. Well, what a noble cause you have, sir. Anybody need their shoes shined? Oh, sir, would you like to get your shoes shined? Okay, I don't, honestly, I don't even know how much it costs. I'm, this is my first day. Oh, uh, I think that's for local stuff. Yeah, you shine local shoes like that guy. Yeah. Oh, okay. There you go. There you go, sir. Oh, I'm going to get your shoes nice and shiny. Right, See? You a good day. Oh, you too, sir. I, I'm a local inventor, sir. Any 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 ideas that you may have for inventions, let me know, and I can I can make it. I, if you can think it, I can build it. All I need is money to put together for a lab. It'll be the greatest lab ever. If you ever heard of Nikola Tesla and his lab, that's the sort of thing I could do. Except without all the science, more more like mechanical inventions. Wow, thank you, sir. Thank you for the tip as well. Oh, this guy's all fucked up. Oh, hello, sir. Would you like to catch your shoes shined? I'm okay, thank you. I appreciate the offer, though. I'm all right, then. Be safe. Oh, sorry. So He's on a stair, master. Yeah, he's got to work out those quads, you know? Work those quads. Work, work those quads. What's your name again, partner? Oh, uh, my name's Eldon Irwin. I'm shining shoes now. Yeah, yeah, that's a that's a decent way to make money. Yeah, it's like twenty to forty cents, but not that bad, you know. Yeah, I got forty-five. Not bad. I think I did a good job on this fellow here. Nice. He's just on the stairmaster, you know. You know, he's it's yeah. another one of my inventions. It'll be really popular in the future, but it working out those quads. Yep. Alrighty, partner. What have we been reduced to? Excuse me, Matt. Oh, uh, hey there, sir. Yeah? Um, have you got a wallet? I'm, I'm not trying to rob you. I just want to make sure that, um, you know, we're in the same boat, if you know what I'm saying. Have you got a wallet? Uh, uh yeah, I, I've got a, I've got a wallet. Well, I still know if everybody got one. Cause I don't, I don't think I fucking got one. Maybe I do have a wallet, but I, I, I think um, I knocked my head on the on the way over, and um, I, I might have forgotten how to do it, you know. What's your name? Well, the name's Michael. Uh, Ma Michael Salisbury. Michael Salisbury. Well, it's nice to meet you, and I'll, I'll remember you when my names are in lights and fireworks for all the inventions I've done. And I'll remember that mullet. Well, I'll make sure you make a helmet that looks just like it. Oh, oh a helmet? <gasps> a helmet that covers your back. As well as... Oh, hold on, let me scribble this down. Oh, yes. A helmet that covers your back and covers your neck as well as your head. Eureka! 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 Well, man, if you make some fucking money out of that, I want a, I want a couple, a couple dollars out of that. Oh, I yeah. Like that. Yes, Ma Michael Sol, Michael Salisbury. Did you say? 
Soul, soul, uh, uh, soul's brain. Soul's brain. Okay, I'm gonna write that name down so that when well, you can get some nice royalty things. checks. Well, that'd be lovely, mate. Really? I'm new in town, I need to find some ways to make some money, you know? I know what you mean. I'm new in town too. I just arrived this morning. But I, I'm no gunslinger or tough guy or anything like that. I, I use my noggin. Oh well, yeah, like I said, sometimes I use my noggin and sometimes it takes people to the ground. Well, listen, guys, this has been a very enlightening conversation and I did get a, an incredible idea. So when I open up my factory, it will be very similar to Nikola Tesla's factory. I'll be creating inventions there and, and yours will be, I'll call it the Salisbury Helmet. Oh, bloody hell, man. I honor and a privilege, my privilege, man. Yeah, and I I'm going to give you 15 points on every sale. 50%? No, 15. One, one five. 50? No, 15. <laughs> okay, well, I better go before he gets up and changes his mind about the percentage. Nice meeting you guys. Salisbury Helmet. Now that's something I'm going to be able to build and market. I'm going to need a prototype. Figuring out how it works. The latest technology known to man. Yes. It's all coming together now. I can see it. Now that we have the product, or at least the idea of it with Salisbury Helmet, I can use that prototype to raise money. I just need to raise a thousand dollars, and then we can really invest in this business. But I need to find the right man, the right business person, someone powerful, someone that can introduce me to others, some connections. Yeah, that's the way forward. around good night Bill. Oh, well, I mean he did so just get yeah, kicked by a horse hey, hey there uh, you think uh, somebody could help me I have a question what's your question uh, well uh, you seem like you you might know where a, a fellow like myself an inventor and a salesman who's gonna change the world might be able to find somebody to give me a loan I have a business proposition for them and I just need to know who who the people are with that kind of money. Well, you didn't oh. send how much money? A thousand dollars to open up my own lab like Nikola Tesla. Damn. You can talk to the person behind you while inside the store. She'll be right in. Oh, he'll be right in. Sure. Yeah. Mr. Dixon will come here in a second and you can discuss yeah, with don't. him. Okay. This is it. I'm I'm practice. I'm gonna have to practice. Sir, sir, can you? I'm looking for a thousand dollars. Thousand dollars for a, a, an opportunity of a lifetime to have our names and lights. Fireworks. Hello, sir. How can I help you? Oh, oh Mr. Mr. You again. Hello. Mr. Dixon, sir. Hi there. How are you doing today? I'm doing well. Sir, everyone t tells me that you're the man to talk to. M my name's Eldon Irwin, and I'm looking for, for an investment of a lifetime, an opportunity of a lifetime, to open up my own laboratory. 
all I need is one thousand dollars to oh, open up my own laboratory you and stop shouting in there. Oh, sorry. Um, open up my own laboratory where I can do my inventions that are gonna change the world, and together we could have our names in lights and fireworks. Opportunities like this only come once in a lifetime. You see, the last person was Edison who helped out Nikola Tesla and everything turned out well in that relationship. I'm offering you the same exact thing. We could have electric toothbrushes. That's right. We could have helmets called the Salisbury helmet. Protects your neck, your back. For those people with epilepsy, sell it to the pharmacies for uh, for a killing. Eldon, well, a thousand dollars is a lot of money. Hmm. Hmm. Well, do you do you uh, do you actually you know do you have do you have a business? Do you have a uh, business uh, name? Do you have any prototypes? Hmm. Hmm. See, I, I can't I can't really invest if you don't have a business, you know, because I'll be taking a cut of the business, you see, for the investment. Uh, I see. So, so what steps would you recommend? I, I would recommend you speak to a lawyer and get, get some. Get something get some on paper, you know, uh, get your business set up. And the lawyer obviously, you know, hopefully speak uh, on your behalf to the government. And hopefully get yourself a, uh, your own little business. And then once you've done that, come see me and I will invest, 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 you know. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay, I, I love that. I'm not going to take any more of your time. This has been super valuable. I'll go find a lawyer right away and see what we can do about getting you a prototype in your hands. Don't you worry, I've got all the time in the world for, you know, people wanting to, you know, technological, lo 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 logically ad ad advance the, you know, mm -hmm. the, the world. And in a few years, it's all going to be different around here. Mm. You could be a part of it. I mean, you already are going to be a part of it. That's why I'm speaking oh, to you in the first place. It's exciting. I feel, uh, I feel like this could be a good business ship, you know, good partnership, good business. And yeah, exactly. hopefully change, change the lives of many. Yeah, I mean, this helmet, Salisbury helmet, it's really interesting. It's a hat. It looks like every other hat. And that's, that's the part of it. And then as soon as you fall, it doesn't hurt you as much. And it protects you. So it's something that we can market really easily. Oh my god, one second. I've, I've, got, the, I've got the perfect guinea pig. Hi. Bill! Paras is not available right now, but he Bill. is... Uh... But merely we'll tell him that we need uh, to talk to him about possibly knowing some lawyers. Okay, okay, excellent. Um, uh, well, uh, I, I need you inside. I, I've got you the, I've got you the job. I don't want any fucking Come inside, I come inside. This could be a perfect guinea pig. He's always falling over. Oh, sir, do, do you find yourself dizzy at times and then other times on the ground and you don't know how he got there? Yeah, one time I found myself in Mexico with a wagon on a rooftop and on a hell of stuff. Okay, well, yeah, that's the sort of thing that, that the Salisbury helmet might be able to help you with. For you, so you see, you might have a case of the epilepsy, just like my aunt, my aunt did. And uh, the idea is that when you lose memory and consciousness, you fall and hit your head, which makes things worse. You can wake up in all sorts of different types of places. So the Salisbury really? helmet, yeah, for a small nominal I price. It was the alcohol. Well, it, it might it might be exacerbating the situation for you. You know, like see this this, this here now I have. See this this is my lovely little bit of tequila now that I got today. Whoa. See now this causes me to go and disappear sometimes, and I wake up in very strange places afterwards. Yeah, it's a, it's it's a problem. Head. No, I do get bumps in my head. Sometimes broken arm. Oh yeah, I, I totally know what you mean, sir. And so Michael Salisbury had the same exact problem after he went to the saloon. So, I invented a Salisbury helmet, and I'm wearing the prototype right now. If you want, I can I can drop it on the ground, and you can take a look at it. The Salisbury helmet. That's right. It's a helmet that covers both your head, your, your the back of your head, and a little bit of your neck. And this way, when you fall, you don't lose memory. Ooh. Try it, Bill. Try it. Go on, then. I'll try it. Ah, excellent. 
Okay, so now... What you're telling me is this will protect my head? Nope. Now when you fall, you won't lose memory. I mean, you're still gonna fall, but it's gonna protect your head. That's the invention. You see, the Salisbury helmet does its thing. So if I just, like, bump my head or fall over or even walking under a small bridge, knock dung, you know, knock off my head? Yeah, exactly. Give it a shot. You'll see how it works. Oh, oh. bloody wind! What the fuck? Ah, sir. Did you not see my helmet? You see how it I worked? Have lots of memory. I've remembered. Amazing. Where I am, I think. Where are we? Any lost them? No, no, no. Oh, fuck. I should say no. And no. But at least he's speaking. And that's the proof yeah. that you need, sir, that yeah. it's working. Yeah, it definitely is working. I kind of hurt my neck, though. Jumping through that window, that wasn't too good. Had it. Hello. Hmm. <laughs> <lie down. laughs> yeah. Be careful with the helmet, let's go. Yeah, uh, and do, you, do you want the helmet back? Yeah, I'd love to take it back if you don't mind. I hope it don't hurt you in the process. <laughs> Perfect. Man, Thank you so place. much. Just how it was. How it exactly. So now it you can all see on it. that the Salisbury helmet is going to be an invention of a lifetime and okay. an investment of a lifetime. Well, well, I really gotta go for a lie down, so I'll okay. see in a little while. Well, I think. I'm, I'm going to donate some start of cash to you. Yes. To get you going. Yeah, let me see how much you've got to be Wally. Thank you so much, Mr. Dixon. This is this is going to be it. You're not going to regret it. Well, I hope, hopefully I, I don't. But there you go. Here's $50. Yeah, excellent. Hopefully Mr. get you on the move. Incredible. Oh, I'm going to put this uh, money right to work, sir. Resonation okay. Wow, we got our first donation for the inventions. The Salisbury helmet. Now I can take this money, put it right in the bank, so that I don't lose it. But I do wonder if I was able to convince Mr. Dixon, with a, such a basic prototype as the hat on my head, to give me money, I wonder who else I'd be able to convince. I hear there are some fellers, they're running big families, that might be interested in investing a little bit more for a bit of a larger share. <laughs>